Hey guys, what's up? Rock Train here. We are doing part four of our Crooked Man Let's Play series. You guys remember from last time we had uh, shit hit the fan, the Crooked Man decided to pop up, and then I got the shit literally scared out of me when the floor fell out around Sissy. That scared the living shit out of me. My headphones are at 100, so everything's really fucking loud. What the? That sound. That's not good. Uh. Hold up, what's up with this? That's oh, nothing. There's someone there. Please don't be there. What the fuck is that? Hello? 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 Is that the mysterious man we've been looking for? Hello? Hmm. Oh, that's not good. Sissy? Sissy, is that you? Sissy? Oh, hey, look, a bar. Let's get there. That's no, locked. Sissy! Sissy, sissy, sissy. <gasps> sissy? I don't even know if I'm supposed to be looking for sissy. Uh, uh, That's still locked. Oh, I feel like clock. Clock is stuck. Sissy. Basement doors open. That's exactly what I was thinking. Well, that's not good. Uh, why not? Oh, hey. Hello? Can I turn this on? Nope. Alright. Well, I'm glad he's not down here, but that means that thumping around was probably him upstairs. Which is not fucking good. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, we gotta go key. To go key, see anything? Oh. Nope, I, I don't. What's that go key we got? I'm slot. Oh. Nope. Nope. Wrong room. Nope. Nope. I think that's a passcode. Yep. I don't understand how Sissy can fucking evade me like crazy. And the fucking crooked man's running around. running around like a spaz somewhere in here. Where the fuck is he? Get in his fucking hole, I can tell you that. Fucking Buffalo Bill. Puts the lotion on its skin or else it gets the hose again. Get the fuck back in your hole. Oh, hey! Drinking time! Actually empty. Empty beer bottles, come on. Oh, that's lame. Let's check this out. Journal seemingly written by a staff member. The last page is rambling and sloppily written. A toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we've got. Hell, it's the only good thing here. Being out of a job's no good. But at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We're so sick of that egghead always trying to flaunt his intelligence. That doesn't really rhyme. Installing weird stuff at the basement door, having a number lock on the food storage, all this silly crap made the place impossible to run. Still not rounding, but that's okay because we're going to sing it anyway. Plus, the passcode was the thing with the book, which he changed up every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's good for him, but sure as hell not us. Ah, whatever. 
Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. A toast to our right futures. Now let's drink a beer. The door to the food storage is at the far end of the first floor, right? The passcode on food is pretty crazy. Yes, but what is the passcode? What is the password? That's like Monty Python, maybe? No? Yes? I'm not sure. Checked in here. Alright. Shoot, there's a passcode somewhere. Give me your fucking password. What is the password? Three? Three candles. I don't know. Check the shelves. Nope. Back tight. Oh, what did I say? Nope, that's fine. Q the R. Type from S T. The blackboard in the inner room said the strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Be on this shelf, right? Ah, here we go. Oh, fuck. I don't want to read the story. Uh, okay. Not going to read that. Back tight, nothing, nothing, nothing. Nope. 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 Cry the unseen. We already read that. Talk about supernatural. Is there anything on here? Nope. Alright. I had no oh! That monster did it really? Uh, come on, come on, run, 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 run. It, it's coming this way. Crap, I've got to escape. Yes, because in a serious, serious situation like this, the first thing I'm going to say is crap. Uh, I am going. Oh fuck. Uh, wait. I got the heebie-jeebies. Fuck, and I forgot to save. Fuck. Fuck, I'm all the way back here? Oh, crap. Alright, well, I'm going to edit this out, guys. And we will flash forward when I arrive. Alright, guys, we are back. So, after that, I don't know how I'm going to escape him. Um. Maybe that's not scared the second time. Dude, he fucking, he's fucking quick as shit. Now, how come he doesn't go fast here? Fuck. Uh, okay. Let's think this through. If I go that way. Oh, he's so quick. What the fuck? Uh, oh, fuck. I can't say fuck. I'm dumb. What about if I jump down? Aha. If I drop him. Oh. Drop him. No, no, no. You drop down. That was anticlimactic as fuck. <sighs> what is that monster? So what I saw earlier? Damn. I can't believe such a thing exists. But there's no way it's coming back now. The room under is locked tight. I should warn Sissy when I see her. I knew it would be dangerous for her. Alright. Sissy! Fuck, my allergies. 201 to 206. Sissy? Gotta be fucking something. Come on. I never checked the piano, did I? No, oh, no. Oh. 
We're gonna try and find that passcode. Figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do. Cause I want to get in that fucking pantry room. I think that's the next place. But can't fucking get in there because there's no fucking code. Hmm. I wonder what's in that room too. Come on, I need something. Anyway, I'm surprised he's even staying here. Maybe I'm not. But maybe I'm supposed to leave. But then Sissy would be by herself, and I don't think they would pull that shit. But after I saw a monster like that, I would totally am scram out of here. Nope, we're not allowed. No surprise there. Uh, be on the steps. Nope. Nope. Looks like a bathroom. Why the hell can't I find a goddamn password? I just want the password, please. What is the password? Hmm. Like this is the room the monster's locked in. I think. Didn't we just come from this room? No? Yes? Oh, nope. Found a toilet. Mirror's filthy. Does this clock have a time on it? Nope. Where the hell am I supposed to go to figure out this passcode? It's definitely it. Oh, code must be wrong. Uh. Oops. Nope. Fuck. Try eighteen seventy six. Nineteen ninety one. Try one more guess. Twenty thirteen. Nope. All right, so. in the basement. Nope, it's not in the basement. Um, fuck. If I were an asshole manager, where the fuck would I keep my code? Fuck. Uh, literally, where the fuck would your code be? I have no idea. I literally have no fucking idea. How the fuck am I supposed to find this fucking code? I refuse to use a guide. So. Can I get behind the bar? Nope, come on. Ugh. Where is the fucking code? I wish there was like a fucking managerial room I could go into. What do I have in my law school leaflet? Uh, two or three. What, what would cigarettes be used for? Smoke. Well, I can't use. Can I, I can't use any of this shit. What the fuck is the point of having it? Fuck. Nope. Hmm. Where the fuck would I? Hmm. If I had a key, where the fuck? All right, here's the owner's room. The answer's gotta be fucking in here. Whoop. Oh. Oh, nope. Where the fuck would I keep a key? Where the fucking... Mm. Ah. Where the fuck would I keep that shit? Why is it... 
Come on, man. Where the fuck would that be? Holy shit, I'm just gonna click in. Alright, full miscellaneous goods. Ah, fuck. Where the fuck would I put a code? It just pisses me off. Was I supposed to have like a little kid's story or some bullshit? Fuck! Where the hell is this code? I just stopped looking because I realized I made a dumbass face. Uh, 7011. Fuck, when was this hotel made? This game is getting boring. Don't know what the fuck to do. How the fuck am I supposed to find the fucking... <clears throat> Where the fuck is Sissy? Can I please trigger an event? Come on. I want to give the people what they want. And they want scars. Sissy, you no fucking cuckold. Where the fuck is this fucking shit I need to find? Is there another loose tile on the floor? Could it be? That's. Nope. What the fuck do I need to do? Dear, give me answers. Uh, nothing, nothing. Nothing. Do you have anything painting? No. Fuck! Schubert. I know nothing about. Sh if I had to know shit from outside the game. I am royally fucked. Come on. Just give me a fucking clue. I need a raging clue. Fuck. Here's my thing. I have a raging clue and it's pointing that way. I know the answer. Maybe. Do I have to go and read the fucking Jekyll and Hyde book? Like, actually read it? No, that's not. They wouldn't make me read a fucking Jekyll and Hyde book, would they? Maybe it's in the plant. Nope, I was dead wrong. Uh, give me some numbers, give me some numbers, give me some numbers. Number, 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 number. 20, 20, 20 years. Alright, we got 20 years. 20 years divided by 4 is 5. 2045, 2045. Nope, that's probably not it. But we can try it. 18. Nearly a year later, 18, 17, 18. Bed 11, 18, 11. 18, 11, and 2005. 18, 11, and 2005. 18, 18, 11, 2005. There's not a single other number. Come on. This is just ridiculous. Oh, come on. The fuck does a guy have to do around here to get a fucking passcode? Alright, let's try it. 2005 and 
If this doesn't work, I'm going to end the video here, and I'm going to start part 5 with us figuring out what the fuck this passcode is. 2005. 1811. Fuck! 20... 34. 9... Three, seven, four, five, zero, four, six. Uh, three, two, oh, oh. My age, twenty two. My dog's age. 86 in dog years. Oh, fuck. That's why I was wrong. 22. 86. 12, 24, 36, 46, 84. But she's, it's like half. Ah, alright. I'm gonna try and figure this out, guys. Uh, I hate to make part four just one fucking jump scare, though. Like, I really wanna figure this the fuck out, but. So I do. I'm just gonna end it here and then we'll figure it out. Uh, save. I really gotta start doing that more. But uh, I hope you guys enjoy another series. Uh, sorry about this one. It's not that great. Oh, you know what I'll do? I'll put up two today, and then we'll figure it out from there. Uh, this has been Rock Train. Signing off. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and. Comment, subscribe, and like my videos. What a shitty outro, but uh, we're going to deal with it. So, choo-choo, motherfuckers. Have a good night, and I will see you later. What's up, guys? Rock Train here. We're doing part five of our Let's Play series. So, when we last left off, we were trying to figure out what exactly it was that uh, made this shit go crazy. Well... Well, not to shit go, make me go crazy because I couldn't figure out the fucking passcode. So, after searching around for about probably like 20 minutes, I came back and I started reading Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. And I read through it and I was like, ah, oh, it's awkward. Shit's missing. I can't read it. Like, I was like, it didn't go in order. So I looked at it again. Chapter 3 is missing. Chapter 6 and 7 are missing. And chapter 9 is missing. So. Thinking logically here. I was like, well, why not? 3, 6, 7, 9. Boom. Unlock the door. And no, I did not look it up. It just took me fucking forever to try and figure this shit out. Cupboard, the hinges are rusted, small run. Yeah, they're all gonna small run. Backlight's cooking utensils, just a pot, small fit, knife. Oh, I came lag there for a second. I was like, fuck. See something shiny, but it's out of reach. Can I hop up on here? See so, huh. so we grab the ladder. Yes, you smart little boy. Got the key to 210. Boom. Alright, now we're cooking with gas. Which is what my fifth grade teacher used to always say. Mrs. Wick, I miss you. Anyway, we are going to 210. Is that here? All the way at the end. All right. Shit's about to get serious. Huh. That's awkward. Looks like something was badly burnt. Dude, was this a photo? Looks like it was a woman. Hmm. Something under the pieces. That scrap from a notebook. I don't need her memory anymore. I know she won't come back. So I forgot every forget everything, good and bad. 
Back! My head hurts. Yeah, mine hurts too. What is that noise? Whew. Settle down. Sheesh. I'm exhausted. I guess I haven't slept much. So he burnt this photo to clear his broken heart, huh? I... I know I couldn't do that. I'll never forget. Not ever. According to Paul, that makes me a pansy. Ah, oh, I thought I said pussy. I got all excited. <gasps> Sissy! Oh, there you are, David! Sissy, you will not believe what happened. I locked this dude in the basement, the crooked man in the room, and there was... There was a loud noise and there was a passcode and all kinds of crazy shit. Did you find the box? No, I can't find it. There are lots of rooms I can't go in. So it might be in one of these. One of those. What's wrong, David? You look kind of pale. Oh, it's nothing. But sissy, you should really leave soon. Why? You may not believe me, but there's some kind of bizarre monster around. I found it in the basement. I was attacked by it earlier. You've definitely be in danger too, so I think you should go. Look, I don't like the dark, scary places either. There's no need to tease me that I'm a, I'm not a kid afraid of the boogeyman. Okay? Uh, sorry, but I'm not trying to tease you. I'm telling the truth. <laughs> don't worry, I'm not mad. You don't seem like a dishonest guy, so I'd like to believe you. But a monster? Maybe you mistook something in the dark. You could be susceptible to seeing things when you wander around in the dark like this. I'd like to think you're right. All right, if you insist, but be careful, okay? I know. Well, I'll go looking elsewhere. <sighs> Sissy, you woman logic, man. I just don't understand it. Uh, clock's not working anymore. Oh, I just sort of scared of that. All right. So once again, we are. Fucking. I was kind of hoping there'd be like something in here. Uh, fuck. Uh. What? Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. A message in red. Was this here before? No, it wasn't, David. Leave me alone. Please leave me alone. Come to me. I'm waiting for you. Oh shit. Sounds pretty inconsistent. I could have written this. No. No. Well, why? I dropped you down a bit. Oh, I didn't save it forever! Crap, I gotta do something. Crap, 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 Fuck. Now, what the fuck can I do? Right here. Alright guys, we're back. Uh, gonna take a quick look around. I don't know. Mm. I don't know, maybe... Alright. Go this way then, I'll have to ever... Come this way, alright. Nope, come this way. Shit. Go. Go! How, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Ugh, fuck! Can I, like, throw the glass at you? Maybe that's what it is. Maybe I gotta get that glass. Come on, buddy. No, come on this way. Yep, good. Game over. No, I couldn't even grab the glass. Fuck. I'm never gonna get out of here. 
I'm sorry, we still got like 10 minutes for me to just fuck up over and over again. <sighs> Empty beer bottles. Awesome. Uh, fuck. Fuck. This way? This way. This way. Hoop. 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 The glass. Uh, why is the music getting louder? I don't know what the fuck to do! Go! I can't- I can't outrun him. It's gotta be something in that room. Fuck! Uh, fuck. Fuck. Why can't I, Why do I suck at games like this? <sighs> Book's not gonna help me. He's so fucking. How about some of this? Oh, here we go. I think I got it. Oh, I guess that won't do much on it. What else can I do? Uh. Alright, so I threw. Uh, this. This. Nope, that wasn't it. Ah, oh, fuck. It's so loud, too. It hurts my ears. It hurts my ears. Alright, so we run. Shoe on. Oh! <gasps> Rock train! I knew you had a brain in there! Kill it with fire. Kill that motherfucker with fire. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, oh shit. You were not supposed to do that. Well, the fuck? That's not fair. Come on, dude. That's not cool. Leave me alone. Alright, so let's do this this way. Shit. Shit. He's on the wrong side. That's alright. I know. Lighter. Aha! Now you're covering alcohol, you should be pretty flammable. Like the bitch on fire. How do we get back here? Ah! Hell yeah. He ran away. Phew. <sighs> uh, no, that's not good, dude. That just means he's gonna come fucking come back. What the hell is that thing? Why is it chasing me? How did it survive before? I might need something to defend myself. Now, where could I look? I don't know. How about that fucking kitchen knife I tried to take earlier that you fucking refused to take? Oh, look, it's a fruit cutting knife. Now, you motherfucker. I'm fucking taking that thing. Look at it. Fucking scared me. Fruit knife. Maybe I should take it just for self defense. Got a knife. Yeah, it's a pretty big fucking knife, bro. Oh, come on. Not this shit. Bl blood? This wasn't here earlier. Did, did something happen to sissy? I better look for it. Oh, bro, if you fucked with my sissy, I swear I will fucking kill you. Where the fuck did my sissy go? Uh, oh. Sissy? Sissy. Sissy, where the fuck did you go, sissy? Sissy, sissy, are you on your period? What's going on here? Sissy, 
Talk to me, sissy. Sissy, what are you doing here? Your arm's bleeding. So is your blood. Where are you hurt? My arm caught on something. It's not that big of a deal. Don't worry about it. It's bleeding a lot, though. And you've been resting here, right? What if you have anemia? Oh, shit, that was David. I'm just a little tired. I've been walking around a lot. Really, don't worry. Da 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 da. Wow. Give me your hand, sissy. I have a handkerchief. So, I can at least try to wrap it up. <gasps> Guess this is better than nothing. Does it? Doesn't it hurt? Chopper screen. It's fine. Oh, fuck. I took it at the wrong time. Thank you. You're so kind, David. Oh. Anything for a girl like you. You don't seem so well. Did something happen? Oh, it's nothing. I've just been so silly. Silly? It's silly that I'm wandering in this dark place all alone, falling in holes, cutting my arm, all to find some measly box. Measly? What do you mean falling in a hole? But it's important, right? A memento from your boyfriend. No, uh, falling in a hole. Falling in a hole. Fuck. You guys are so stupid. Well, he's my ex to be exact. Oh, David. David, this is your chance. Hop on that. Rebound. Rebound. Huh? No, don't huh? Rebound. Oh, God. He left me quite a while ago. But while we were dating, this hotel was our special place. That was when I lost the box. I've been worried about it ever since, but I only worked up the courage to come look. I thought I could forget everything about him, but it was no good. Coming here brought back all the memories. Oh, shit. She's a little girl, right? Uh, mm, I think, I think she, the guy David's looking for, that's his ex-girlfriend. Why did you break up? I don't know. Okay. Maybe that's why I won't give up. He said he appreciated my kindness, but when we broke up, he said it was all I had, and he was exactly right, so I couldn't reply. Oh, sissy. I really am a whip. I wanted to break up with me. Even I need a girl like me. When in logic. Sorry, female gamers. Sorry, I know I'm just annoying you. I'll rest here a while longer. I'm a little dizzy. Thanks for your help, David. No problem. David to the rescue. Now, where's my rescue BJ for the second time? Oh, I found this. I'm not sure where it goes, though. Got a key. I think I have a hunch where it goes. Thanks. Don't strain yourself, okay? Well, I'm going. No, why would you leave her alone? There is a blood trail. Oh, you guys are so freaking stupid. Come on. Alright. Well, we're going to end it here for part four. I really don't like where this is going because I feel like Sissy's going to die. And I kind of like Sissy. She's redhead. I got a thing for redheads. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. But, uh, I think I, think I know what's going to happen. Sissy's going to be this dude's girlfriend. And the dude is the monster. My hunch. We'll see what happens. This is Rock Train signing off. Choo-choo, motherfuckers. I will see you next time.